from that far away. He's like, what the fuck? Man, I got fucking mur- <laughs> Ah, the lead! Oh no, you're using an STG and you got sniped. Boo-hoo. Bro, what? Damn, right to our left. To your left. Oh! No. Oh, oh, inside that no. bill. Hello. There's no fucking what? <laughs> He's so bad. I'm sorry. I'm better than you. Get over yourself. You're using an STG. Tommy UAV still yeah, fucking out, bro. Real, really oh my is. god, locals. Dude, we were gaming right there. Let's go. But again, it unfortunately doesn't matter because the merciless doesn't stack. I I'm so sad. Sledgehammer, please fix this. Alright, yo guys, what's going on? It's Sore Rage, and welcome back to some more Call of Duty Vanguard. So over the course of the second weekend, I got maxed out to third prestige, and I also spent a lot of time on leveling and getting both the Bazooka as well as a Panzer Shrek Gold. I knocked out those launchers, but in the meantime, I have spent so much time on this three-line rifle. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love the Mosin in this game, but my god, it has taken forever. <laughs> now, the reason that's why it's taken so long is because for some reason, again, I'm assuming that Sledgehammer is going to fix this, but you have to get one 100 bloodthirsties on the Mosin. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I spent a vast majority of Saturday and yesterday's stream on Sunday just specifically working on bloodthirsties. I think I started the weekend at like 15 or something like that. Got a good majority of it done on Saturday and then uh, finished it up up until this point in time here yesterday on Sunday. So we've only got 12 more bloodthirsties left to go. Now, as far as the uh, individual challenges go, I've uh, obviously left them here with less than 10 to do, but one of the biggest things that I wanted to go ahead and talk about is the fact that the Golden Mosin shouldn't even be able to be unlocked because as you guys can see here with this challenge uh you have to get kills while using the vital proficiency and that's not a thing on the mosin challenge says you have to get 100 headshots using the 500 millimeter custom barrel with the 30 odd 620 round magazines and the vital proficiency however this is obviously a bug obviously again vital is not a choice here but the way that you get this done is you have to use the hard scope proficiency it's very evident that a lot of the challenges have been just copied and pasted across a lot of the weapon categories here but when it comes to the these challenges that can't be unlocked depending on a certain proficiency my best guess would be to change out each proficiency or attachment whatever it may be try changing them out every single game see what counts and uh, if it turns out that nothing works then we're just gonna have to wait for a fix but in the case of the Mosin here since vital wasn't a proficiency I was told to throw on hard scope and it worked and real quick I wanted to give a huge thank you to one of my twitch viewers reverse he was the one who let me know of uh, how to get this to work properly so that's gonna be the plan for this video we're gonna go ahead and finish out the rest of these challenges only got to get 10 more long shots Shots using the 270 millimeter carbine barrel. Again, the 30 odd 620 round mags with this Kovalevskaya SO1 stock. And then lastly, the get 100 ADS kills with the 303 British 5 round mags, MN custom sock, and the shrouded proficiency. And also, in the meantime, while we're working on this, I'm going to see what I can do about uh, destroying more stuff with the Panzerfaust because these launchers are going to be the death of me. It also turns out that we got a new playlist Small Zone Blitz, blitz pacing for zone based objective modes on small maps. This probably isn't going to go over very well for sniping, but you know, whatever. We'll go ahead and give it a shot. Actually, what I just realized is probably isn't a good move because I still need long shots. I'm gonna have to change the playlist to get here in a moment. So I guess the first thing we'll go ahead and complete is the uh, last of these ADS challenges. Uh, sir, you cannot be in a worse position. Bro, I, I can't move. I, I can't seem to get anything going right now. It's my first game on. I'm just getting on and getting okay all right well first game on already getting completely slaughtered oh man what have i done <laughs> yeah i am so sick of this challenge man oh my goodness that is some unfortunate timing, my good sir. It's always these ADS challenges with the snipers because they, they make you put on the really shitty attachments. Then you basically end up hit marking everything under the sun. So far, though, I really do like the Mosin. I, I feel like this is probably going to be my main sniper throughout the course of the year because as it stands, it's got a really solid fire rate to it. Really solid damage. I know a lot of people have been gassing up the car and uh, I just haven't used it that much. I think it's like level 5 or something for me. I've also seen a lot of snipers still gas up the Type 99 Arasaka and I don't know what it is. Maybe I'm just complete dog water, but I can't use that thing. To me personally, it gets way too many hit markers, and I've always just preferred the, uh, like, slightly slower, but more consistent one-shot rifles. I did see on Twitter, though, there was a leak of the, uh, Lee Enfield, which is eventually going to come to the game, and I think that was the last ADS kill I needed. All right, thank you. I'm not sure when the Lee Enfield is going to be coming to the game, uh, if you guys know what I'm talking about, or better yet, if you guys just played the campaign. It was in a couple of missions in the campaign, and I'm assuming it might come for season one. I, I highly doubt it's going to come in the update, probably tomorrow for shit. Man. Now here on this class, I have to do my best to uh, try and hit some headshots. There we go.
bro. My shot is not there at all right now. Oh my god. Ammo box. Thank you. Thank you for not moving. I, I really appreciate that, sir. Yeah, that was a really bad move going into the small map playlist for my first game on. Uh, we're not gonna do that. And of course, it turns out I only need two. Great. You're in the thick of it now. I still want to know what Sledgehammer Dev decided to put you're in the thick of it now. Into the thick of it? Yeah, I'm fucking sick of it. One. Okay. And two. Now, I just realized we're playing Tuscan, and uh, I just don't think that's gonna happen on this map. I might honestly have to lobby fish because I, I don't think there's actually a single spot on this map that I can hit long shots on. Oh, perfect. I'm knocking out all these long shots right now. Later, partner. There's one. Later, partner. <laughs> this guy just... Later, partner. It looks like a lot of us got the exact same idea. We just... Four of us posted up here waiting for people to cross. We trade. We trade it. Sometimes I forget that it's still a thing in Call of Duty. I, like, I'm, I'm still not used to it. Loop palm. Was that it? 100 long shots already? Nice. So now at this point in time, all I really got to focus on is just uh, getting bloodthirsties. And I, I really hate now that this is like the last thing that I have to do. Because I, I hate the feeling of pressure. It sounds horrible to say out loud. Yes, like genuinely getting nervous over Call of Duty. But like, hear me out. Uh, going for Bloodthirsties is a million times harder when you're actually having to focus on them. And also one thing that I've realized in this game, they don't stack. So Bloodthirsties, Merciless, Ruthless, like whatever you go on, all these killstreaks in increments of five don't seem to count. And the game just, okay, really? Oh, my entire game just crashed. Uh... Oh my god. Can I get a break, dude? Oh my god. All right, thankfully, even after the crash, it still counted my one bloodthirsty, and I completed all the other challenges. Okay, so I'm, I'm glad everything is sticking. Now I still gotta sit here and get 11 more bloodthirsties, which still begs the question, why is it different on the Mosin? Currently, it's Monday afternoon, and I don't know if I'm gonna have time to get this video up specifically today. It'll probably go up tomorrow on Tuesday, but I swear, knowing my luck, shipment is supposed to be coming this Wednesday on the 17th, and I, I have a sneaking suspicion that... Of course, I'm gonna go ahead and get these 100 bloodthirsties, and then all of a sudden, it's it's gonna be fixed, and it's gonna go back down to 30. I swear, if that turns out to be true, I, I might lose my mind. I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. All right, triple kill to start the game, though. From that far away, he's like, what the fuck? Man, I got fucking murdered. See, sometimes I really sit here when I'm recording videos and I debate if I need to mute the game chat, and it's, it's times like that where I'm glad I don't. Oh, they all... <laughs> What oh, the fuck, man? Oh, teammate, please don't stand in my way like that, dude. No, get out of my way. I hate playing like this, being actually scared. Yeah, okay, I'm 10 more bloodthirsties. God, lead. Oh, no, you're using an STG and you got sniped. Boo-hoo. Oh my god! There's really no way you're complaining about getting sniped when you're using an STG. Given the current state of this game, I don't understand how anybody can complain about getting sniped by bolt actions. Alright, well, I'm on a Merciless and it didn't even matter because it's not going to count as two. Again, though, it really begs the question, though, why don't they stack? I mean, for example, though, if it's going to be a hundred bloodthirsties, I mean, you may as well make it count if you get killstreaks in increments of five. Dude, like, what the- Yes, I'm simply better than you. Behind us, behind us. Another bloodthirsty, there we go. Because, like, now it just kind of seems pointless to go on these higher kill streaks. I mean, if, if the Merciless isn't gonna count, I may as well just get five kills and die over and over and over again. He's shooting our recon. There's another bloodthirsty, there we go. Bro, what? Damn, right to our left, to your left. Oh! No. Oh, inside that no. no! Hello. There's no fucking way! <laughs> He's so bad! I'm sorry, I'm better than you. Get over yourself. You're using an STG. Counter UAV still yeah, fucking out, bro. Real, really oh my god, am. locals. Dude, we were gaming right there! No. Let's go! But again, it unfortunately doesn't matter because the Merciless doesn't stack. I I'm so sad. Sledgehammer, please fix this. I feel like I just said this, though, but honestly, I, I really wouldn't mind them keeping it 100 bloodthirsties as long as the like kill counts in increments of 5 would count. Like, again, if you go on a Merciless, it should count as 2, Ruthless should be 3, good, another bloodthirsty, good. Relentless should be 4, Brutal 5, you know, so on and so forth. Oh, hello? Oh no, I'm terrified, I'm terrified. The moment I look away from here, someone's gonna shoot me. I'm Oh, and the patrol's moving my way, please. All right, bloodthirsty. Oh, 
There's another bloodthirsty. If I haven't already mentioned it, that area right there is also a really solid area to get some long shots. Fuck you. I have a sniper. You were winning the gunfight regardless. Finally down to the last two bloodthirsties. Thank you. I just died twice off of two separate four kill streaks. I I am fuming on the inside right now. Where the fuck? Damn it! <laughs> I'm gonna lose my mind. I'm gonna lose my mind. This, 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 this just isn't real. This isn't real. I can't believe I just went on four, five separate four kill streaks and died every time. Uh, that That is the worst feeling ever. One more. Oh my goodness, dude. There it is. Yeah, don't you ever fucking try jump shotting me again. Oh my good lord. <sighs> There, there, there it is. Dormant unlocked and gold. Oh my goodness, man. I'm getting so sick and tired of being jump shotted and slide canceled on. I, I swear, Call of Duty needs to go back to just dolphin diving one year and I want to watch everybody lose their minds. 100 bloodthirsties. I, I'm, I'm going to be thinking about this for a while. Was it really worth the heart palpitation? Was it really worth the headache? I unlocked gold on the three line rifle, but now I need some ibuprofen. <laughs> See, the thing is though, is that I really do enjoy sniping with the Mosin. Like, th this is a really, really fun sniper to use. It's just that, uh, my god, stressing over bloodthirsties like that is not fun. There it is, though, the gold three-line rifle. I mean, now, to be fair, though, this Mosin does look really, really good gold, but oh my goodness. I mean, like, typically, I would just jump back into another game, but right now, I just, all right, I, I, I need to get off and take a break for a minute. Still, as it stands for right now, the Mosin is my favorite sniper. Now, again, I, I haven't even really used the car yet. Uh, the, the Arasaka is just not it. I also don't even know if I showed the loadout that I've got on this thing, but here you guys go. Again, it's pretty much all just built for ADS speed. I was actually pretty surprised though to see that the uh, 30 6 even though it says it takes away 2 fire rate, it really doesn't make that big of a difference because the fire rate goes from 38 38.7 rounds per minute, but if you throw in the British 5 round mags, which does increase it a little bit, it brings it up to 40.9 To me though, the biggest difference is the damage. You got 128 on this as opposed to the base 92, so I'm just kind of like, eh, it's, it's, it's not really worth it Honestly, I think the bolt speed is kind of fine as is. It was still surprisingly uh, decent enough with a 20 round mag, so that's why I ran this instead, but uh, overall, yeah, very, very solid sniper. It's just going for bloodthirsties being the last thing is literally the worst thing ever when you're stressing about it. <laughs> so again, though, later on this week, I'm assuming this video is going to go up on Tuesday, but uh, tomorrow should be the day that shipment gets added to the game. I really just think I'm going to go ahead and face tank it and just get the diamond ride shield and knife done. Just get those out of the way. Hopefully they fix the stun challenge though, and then uh, shortly after that, I'll go back to the sniping and start leveling up the car, because again, mine's only at like level 5, so I'll have have diamond sniper soon but uh the plan for now i'm gonna try and knock out this riot shield when shipping gets added to the game so on that note guys thank you all so much for watching this video i do apologize for the rage but that quite literally is my name and also if you guys are interested feel free to go ahead and join into my discord that's linked down in the description below so you guys never miss pings when i post new videos here to youtube as well as when i go live on twitch once again thank you guys so much for checking out the video really hope you guys enjoyed leave a like if you guys enjoyed subscribe if you're new it's been so rage and i'll talk to you guys later take care everybody